Uh, Greg Luce, I'm Technical Product Manager with Pioneer for Southern Iowa and Missouri and here to uh, talk a little bit about impact and uh, what impact is is a, uh, a program that we're moving into where we test our hybrids in their last year of testing uh, as an experimental uh, before they're commercially released in research plots throughout North America and the idea is to intensively plant uh, plots. Every sales area in the country is going to have around 30 corn and about 30 soybean locations. These will be planted with special uh, research equipment, uh, but it's not your traditional research type plots. Um, normally research plots are two to four rows wide and maybe uh, a thousandth of an acre long. These plots are eight rows wide by 52 feet long for corn and about 35 feet long for soybeans. So by uh, making the strips bigger, we're really um, in effect testing what we call mini strips. So we're getting a, a lot bigger look at the hybrid. It's protected by border rows, so height between corn hybrids, for instance, is not a factor. Part of the emphasis of this is to test our products throughout all kinds of environments across North America, specifically for the area that I work, uh, Iowa and Missouri. We want to test all types of uh, soil conditions. Um, we want to look at uh, management areas that might uh, might have more disease problems, areas that are more poorly drained, fields that uh, are high yielding as well as those that are stress prone or more drought prone so that we can get a, a much better picture of how these products as experimentals perform in our area. Then the next step is to go from what we call it, these impact plots to product knowledge plots or PKP plots is the, the term we often use. What PKP plots are is once a product is, is advanced commercially, it gets a number, a commercial number, but we limit the amount of sales that first year and we have a very extensive on-farm strip testing program to test those products as far as not only how they're going to just all out yield in great conditions, but to even more extensively um, test them under the extremes. So um, we'll know by the time we uh, come to volume with products, um, exactly how those products are going to perform. We'll have a better idea of how they'll do under multiple type growing conditions.